I think all young people need guidance growing up and for many of the young people that I work with, they've been guiding themselves, they've been growing up themselves. They make mistakes, you know, they think this is the right way but it's actually the wrong way. A young person I'm working with at the moment, he's had a very difficult past. His father died when he was quite young but his memories of his father are, you know, his father running him over with his car, his father smashing him through a shop window. After his father died, he was then taken into care. They found him a supported house placement where he said the first day he moved in, one of the boys who lived in the house called his friends to come and beat him up. So he literally just left. Three years later, he had been living in a van. So by the time Kids Company picked him up, he had no passport, no provisional, wasn't registered to, to any dentist, it's almost like he was someone who didn't exist. His emotional state is one that I've never seen before. He says it himself, he says the reason my life is messed up is because no one's ever showed him any love and no one's ever supported him. You're talking about these children just needing, needing to feel valued. On the streets with these gangs, they feel valued, they, they have a sense of purpose, you know. Gangs are being their role models and they are showing them some form of love and affection. Someone says, you know, here's a pound, go get yourself some chicken and chips. You know, I'm meeting eight and nine year olds. This is their perception of how life is and this is what they're aspiring to. I think for the young people, it's hard for them. I see it's hard for them. Problems with education, problems with finances, problems with gangs. A lot of them have no hope or they, they have no direction. You have organisations like Kids Company to support you. That's what these young people need. They need emotional support, they need to be taught, they need time and care and affection.